hey guys welcome back to my channel for today's video we're gonna do this calm look um it was like a chatty get ready with me but i just wanted to do my makeup because i didn't feel good so i decided to record it because i haven't really posted videos like that so yeah this is what i did if you guys want to see how i get this look then keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe i wanted to do an eyeshadow look i'm feeling kind of sick so i just i want to do my makeup so i can feel when you look good you feel good um for my brows i always use this palette because i like to match my hair to my brows and i feel like this palette has every color except gray am i right but yeah i love gray so i'm using this shade for my brows this one right here i'm using my elf concealer in medium sand i'm gonna conceal my brows I'm just blending with this Morphe M174 brush. I always look and I know the name. Like you could tell it's rubbed off, but I know the name because I'm always using the, this brush. It's my favorite brush to blend out concealer. I ran out of this foundation. Next, can't stop, won't stop in the shade caramel. Got another one. I love it. I love this foundation. It's so good. Love this foundation. <laughs> My gums hurt. This is the F4 brush from AOE Studio. I do with a sponge because I don't want to get it into my hair. And I feel like it doesn't when I do it with a sponge. But this sponge sucks in mad product. Like That's why I don't like the real techniques like that because it sucks in a lot of product. Oh, that was a Born This Way Concealer in Almond. And then this is the Wet n Wild Contour Stick in Where's Walnut. And I'm using the Real Techniques brush in 200. This is the Expert Face Brush. But like, should I? Nah, I'm not gonna, actually, I'm gonna spray my face tomorrow. But that's you. I have yet to try this. I only sprayed it once when I have no makeup. But yeah, this is the pink one with aloe vera and rosemary, rose water. Let me just spray my face real quick. Just because I felt like the concealer dried a little bit. I'm gonna take some of the leftover concealer that I had from concealing my brows and put that on my eyelid. For powder, I'm gonna use my Born This Way, the Too Faced, and Translucent. I love this powder. Do y'all hear people fighting outside? 
Like, shut up, bro. It's always something. The fuck you mean in Brooklyn? First of all, this ain't Brooklyn. And what you gotta say about Brooklyn? Like, I'm gonna press it all into my skin. And then I'm gonna take my Real Techniques setting brush, take some of that powder, and set my eyelids. So I re-upped on this bronzer. It's called NYX Matte Bronzer. You guys have seen this on my channel. It's in deep tan. But I used to use this all the time. I'm gonna just bronze up my face. I'm gonna put brow in my waterline. I'm using this shade from the James Charles palette right here. A little one liner. I keep forgetting when I work on my eyes, I have to carve out my face. Where's my sponge? I'm gonna use the Amuse blush and doll face. Lately for my highlight, I have been using this Godian palette. Looks like that. So pretty and I use a second shade here I'm gonna use the Palladio lip liner in suede. I recently bought this NYX suede matte lipstick. This is so creamy and like it's so it's creamy the word like it's matte but it's so soft like it doesn't dry on my lips after i apply it like the anastasia one that should be having my lips look like cement this is stay glossy lip gloss in bare minimum from Rimmel london you just use this all the time So that's it for my makeup. This is how the makeup looks. I love, bro, I love how it came out. Like I said, when you look good, you feel good because I feel a little better just because like, I don't know, like makeup was always like, you know, my happy place. So I love doing my makeup. So yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all. Happy New Year and yeah, stay tuned for my next one.